Germs are hardly anything we give a second thought as they are not visible to the naked eye, but trying to avoid these little invaders can prevent one from catching certain diseases. These include common colds and influenza, and considering that we are in the winter season, it is quite relevant that we know how to lower the chances of catching dreadful colds. But before we even go there, which are some of the places we find these germs? Lifestyle and One spoke to a local occupational therapist to give us more insight. We're exposed to germs all the time. Um, we interact in environment and, and share a world with many other organisms, not just people. Um, so when we cook food and prepare meals, we're exposed to germs. When we share space with other people, we're exposed to germs. Germs are commonly spread in four different ways. One, contact. Two, droplets. Three, air. And the fourth, vector organisms. With regards to contact, one of the main forms of contact that spreads germs is kissing, particularly the way the French do it. As much as kissing offers many health benefits, such as stress reduction, it can transmit many germs, including those that cause cold sores, tooth decay, as well as glandular fever. There are about 100,000 million germs in one mill of saliva. So yes, you are exposing yourself to germs when you, when you kiss, or French kiss. Um, but kissing also has very beneficial effects because it increases your, your sense of belonging, your bonding, um, and builds your relationship with your partner. And, and with humans, it shows love and affection. So not to say don't kiss, but to be aware that you can pick up diseases through kissing, um, hepatitis B. Locking of lips can also be beneficial in that this exposure to germs is good to a certain extent as it jumpstarts the immune system, thereby strengthening it. There are ways to lessen the spread of germs and even though they might seem so common, it actually goes a long way. It's difficult to reduce the contact that you have but what you can do is wash your hands more frequently um, to protect yourself against the transmission from hand to mouth nose, eyes, etc. Hand washing can insulate you or protect you against picking up a, 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 a diarrhea or gastrointestinal infection by up to 50% and up to 25% for colds and flus you could reduce that transmission. So hand washing plays a significant role. So next time you're at work on your keyboard, phone, or even just at a mall shopping, remember simple things like washing your hands often can make this winter season less unpleasant by fighting off those little bugs.